One, two, three. Oh wait, do I say hi first? Yes. Okay. I'm the guest. <laughs> hi everyone, it's Darren, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am joined by my little sister. Linnell, hello everybody. Yes, and the last YouTube video that you saw from both of us, I think you were only eight when we did the Bean Boozled Challenge. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I am now 10 years old. And uh, today we're doing this video because it was her idea and she's been addicted to TikTok recently. So what are we going to do? Today we are going to do TikTok recipes. Yes. Oh. That she really wants to make. So mm. we're going to go do it today. Yeah. <laughs> so awful. Okay, so what are we going to make first? So we're going to be making the cookie mug. Cake. We we saw that they used Oreos, but another person used normal chocolate chip cookies too. So we're gonna try and do that. So what do we need? First, we need a fork or something to crush it with. We need any type of container that you're gonna be putting your cake in. You need and, a mug. Well, technically. Cause it's a mug cake. Interrupt me again, I dare you. Yes. Mm -hmm. We're going to need a mug, of course, because it is a mug cake. And we're going to need chocolate chip cookies. Oh wait, we need, so we need milk. 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 What they did in the video, they got three cookies. So do you want to do that? And they put it into the mug. One, two, two three. three. And then we're going to put milk into it. I actually don't know how much milk, because they no. didn't really say. Oh my gosh. So we should probably just like eyeball it. Yeah. Just crush it for now. Okay, so. It actually looks. Kind of disgusting. Six and a half hours later. I'm gonna help you. I'm As you can see, you. I'm not that strong yet. So. No, it's just that you have to really, really crush it. Two thousand years later. Okay. There's a lot going on here. And the tell. batter looks Just chunky. Just like that, chunky. Like, <laughs> it looks like baby puke. And then we're gonna put this into the microwave. For about two minutes or I mean, possibly one. Yeah, we're gonna put it in for one minute first, just okay. to be safe. And now we wait. Now we wait. It's kind of liquidy still. Yeah. So I think we should pop it in for about one more minute. Oh, another minute. You can see it there. I don't know if you can see it. So we're gonna put it in for another minute. Okay, we're good. Okay, and there now the cookies go. are done. So we're gonna be putting this later, so we're gonna put it to the side. Oh, well, it kind of turned a little bit different. <laughs> different. Did we put too much milk? Wait, I don't know. we are gonna poke it and we will see if it's... We should have used a toothpick. Oh, okay, oh, okay, it's, okay done. it's good. It's done. Okay, so now we're going to... Taste it. Okay. Wait, so how much do I like put? A scoop. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Um, <laughs> that's a scoop. Okay, we're just gonna let it sit for a bit because it just came out of the microwave. Whoa, it looks good. Whoa, wait, I want to try it. Mm. Is it good? The cake is good. It was at this moment that William knew he up. It's, hot. <laughs> it's too hot. <laughs> no, but when you put the ice cream and the cake together, it's not gonna be hot. I put ice cream. It's good, isn't it? I might finish this. It is. Okay, how would you rate this from one to 10? Like an eight? I'm going with a nine for a rate. It's really good. <laughs> Do you want some? Yeah, but not right now. Just, just save some for me. Okay. We are going to make coffee. Del yeah, Dalgona coffee. Dalgona, I can't. And say this it. is the most popular one, which kind of started like the TikTok food trend thing. So we're gonna watch it to see how it's made. Okay, first things first, get yourself a big bowl and some instant coffee. Into the bowl, we're gonna throw in equal parts coffee, white sugar, and hot water. Now, I do not have a hot water dispenser, so I had to boil it manually. Once you have everything in there, get yourself a hand mixer. And we're just gonna beat our mixture until it's like a light caramel brown. I decided to add more sugar just because I like my coffee sweet. Once you get something like this, try it out to see if you like it. If you do, let that vibe on the side and get yourself a cup and some almond milk. Boom. And 
Finally, you put the broth on top. Well, I can't have coffee, so you're fine. We get how it's made. So this is why I'm hold I've been holding this mixer for a few minutes now. So for what we're gonna need is a spoon. <laughs> it works. A spoon, it a works. bowl, uh, instant coffee, and sugar, and a. Mixer. Okay. What we're gonna do first is we're gonna put the instant coffee, that's a lot of instant coffee, <laughs> into a bowl. Okay. Can you? Can no. You, no, okay. So. Thank you. Now we have the hot water. Should I just pour it? <laughs> Don't pour all of it in though. Till, oops. Okay, okay, okay. I think that's good. Enough. I think it's, it's good enough. Yeah. This is the almond milk. I'm just gonna pour it into our cup here. You can see how this is really thick. Oh. That looks good. That does look good. I'm gonna put this in now. And we even plug the mixer. And it just goes into there. Oopsie daisies. Oh yeah. Okay. It tastes like the coffee flavored candies. That looks so good. Maybe someday I can finally try this. Okay, because I haven't tried it, I'm gonna ask you. From one to 10, how would you rate this? By your looks, I would say, 10 or not. Yeah, that's so cool because it's creamy and it's like thick. If you guys really like coffee, you should try this. And if you guys don't have a mixer, you guys can use a whisk. Matagal nga lang, pero pwede rin gumamit ng fork. Yeah, I rate this a 10 out of 10. This, this is a good one. Moving on. Okay, so now we are going to be doing the egg sandwich and this is more of a life hack. Yeah. So. We already preheated our oven and we already put our oil. Oh, our stove. stove. Yeah. Stove, I'm sorry. Yeah, because the the okay, do you wanna watch it first? We're okay, gonna yeah, watch sure. it. Take three eggs, mix them up as an omelet, pour your omelet into a preheated pan, put in two pieces of bread, butter on one side, butter it side up. When it's cooked on the bottom, flip it over. Two pieces of cheese. <laughs> that looks good. It does look good. Oh. The other side. Eat swap. That looks good. Okay. Okay, guys. So, anyways. So we, we have, have our. <laughs> <laughs> we have three eggs. We have our two cheeses. And we have oil on our pan. So I'm gonna start cracking the eggs and we have three pretty big ones. Oh, I do, I use a micro. So now I'm going to start mixing these. I'm not that good at beating eggs. And now we are going to pour this into the pan. So we're just gonna wait for that for a bit. And, and then we also have our buttered, buttered bread. So the only one side is buttered. Wait. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Is that safe? There we go. I have to learn how to cook before I get married. This is a disaster. <laughs> I think it's fine. Just hold on, Susan. Do not recreate anything <laughs> you just saw. Like with this pan, do not recreate anything that you just saw. Besides other hacks that we said you should try. At this point, we realized that this whole thing was a fail, so here's me recreating it the day after. I just woke up and I really wanted to try making the egg sandwiches again. Let's see how it goes today. So now I'm gonna put the scrambled eggs in. Okay, so now I'm gonna put my buttered toast on top. There we go. So I got that and now it's time to flip it. Oh, hey, I'm so happy. Okay, 
We're so. gonna add some cheese now. So there's one piece of cheese. And then here's another Ooh, piece, piece of cheese. Two pieces of cheese. Were you proud of that? Yeah, I am. I'm very proud. I feel like a master chef. Okay, now. Now we're gonna fold in the, the, the egg on top of the cheese. Can you please cooperate? You're already doing so well. Oh, it's a bit burnt, but it's fine. Oh, that looked good. Look how much better this turned out to be. Whoa, that looks so good. I mean, just look at it. All the cheese, all the egg. So good. And, and that, that concludes, concludes our video for today. Yes, our TikTok food making for today. I really like this. I enjoyed this the most. And a lot of these were pretty quick to make. And I understand why it's a pretty crazy trend right now going on on TikTok. And a lot of them taste really good. Mm -hmm. And my little sister also has a YouTube channel. Except I haven't started posting, but I think I might. <laughs> she's gonna she's gonna do it soon. She's like, she's like me. I'll put the link down below in the description. And you guys can go subscribe to her. And of course, if you like this video, please don't forget to like and comment and of course subscribe to my channel as well. See you guys next time. Bye!